Hi everyone, it's Miss Dawn with her friend Baby Yoda to talk to you about shapes today. Last week we talked about flat shapes like a circle, square, triangle, rectangle. Today we're going to talk about fat shapes. These are shapes that are not flat like a piece of paper, but fat instead. You might be like, hey, Miss Dawn, I know that shape. Yes, you're right, you do. That's a circle that goes round and round. It has no sharp edges to it or anything. You're like, but I know this too, that's a ball. You're right, it is a ball. A ball is also called a sphere, where it's round, it rolls. Sometimes you can bounce them. That was a loud bounce. It's also a fat shape. Like if you were to blow this up, like a balloon, you would get this, a sphere. Can you say that word, sphere? I also have here my flat square. Remember, a square has four equal sides to it. And it this square is also flat, see? But if you were to blow it up like a balloon, you would get a fat square like this. Yeah, you're right, it's a box. Most boxes are shaped like cubes. This is a cube. And it has all the same characteristics of a square, four equal sides. If you look at it from the bottom or the side or the top, but it's fat. So it's called a cube. And most boxes are shaped like cubes. If you get any boxes coming from the store with food or supplies or anything, you could take a look at your boxes and see which ones are shaped like cubes. Sometimes the boxes will come in a different shape and they'll look like this. Hold on. This one's is on the floor. See that? Here's another box. Wait, what's that? Yes, you're right. That is shaped like a rectangle if you look at it from the top. It has the two short sides and the two long sides, four sides, just like a flat rectangle. But again, <clears throat> this one is fat. This is called, it's a long word, you guys ready? Rectangular prism. Can we do the syllables in that? Rectangular prism. Let's count how many syllables that was. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's a lot of syllables with that word. And the last 3D shape I have is my candle. This candle works with a battery because we don't want to play with fire. That's not smart. A cylinder looks like your paper towels, your toilet paper, maybe a lamp in your house looks like this, but it has a circle at the top a circle at the bottom, but it rolls. See, I don't know if you guys can see it rolling like that on the box. That's a cylinder. Can we do the syllables for cylinder? Cylinder. One, two, three. Let's go over these one more time. We have our cylinder, our rectangular prism. our cube in our sphere. So look at that, we learned some names of 3D shapes today. Would love for you guys to go around your house. Maybe you can find me a cylinder or a rectangular prism, a cube or a sphere in your house. It could be like a um, scavenger hunt. Ooh, something fun to do on this rainy day. I know, I'm getting a little tired of the rain too, but gives us more time to stay inside and do some more learning, okay? Baby Yoda and I miss you guys very much. We can't wait to see you. Please keep sending me your videos, your messages, things that you're learning or finding in your house that have to do with our lessons because it just makes me so happy to hear from you guys. I love you all very much, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.